So, I don't usually cover leaks or spoilers unless it's officially announced, but since we're so close to a release date of this special, according to the wiki anyways, I decided why not. So warning, this video does contain spoilers for the upcoming season 5 Ben 10,010 episodes or special. I'm honestly not even sure whether it's a special or just chopped up into a few episodes, but regardless, there's spoilers. So recently, photos and leaks of Ben 10,010 were released, or leaked, maybe both. At first, I wasn't sure what video I could make out of a 16 second teaser, but the more I kept thinking about it, the more I wanted to talk about it. I also, I guess I kind of forgot, like, covering this kind of stuff is just what I do now. So, the teaser starts with some citizens in New York running away from a swarm of creatures within a crumbling city. We get a glimpse of an adult Gwen and this new version of Ben 10,000 looking off in the distance at an oncoming threat while dark clouds form above him. A plot given by the Ben 10 wiki states, in a distant future, where Gwen is President of the United States, the Earth is under attack by an alien horde. Gwen leads the resistance against the threat. Ben, on the other hand, has been out of touch with his family for a long time. After being persuaded to come out of retirement, the grown-up Ben returns to the past to ask young Ben for help. Only together can they repel an attack that threatens, that threatens the future. A lot of people were thrown off as to why he looks so out of it compared to the other Ben 10,000s we've seen before, but being in retirement not only makes sense, but it's the best explanation you could have had. I just wonder what experience it was that pushed this version of Ben away from everyone else. So the new villain of this plot is going by the name Extra, that's X-T-R-A. Whoever that may be, it's possible Ben messed up so badly and failed to save someone, Extra got away, he just, and he just decided to take advice from Endgame Thor. Of course, the first Ben 10K we met had an altercation with Vilgax in his early 20s, which shifted his personality and made him so cynical. I feel like an interesting take would be that this Ben got so powerful and fought so many battles that he just got tired of it all until this new threat challenged him and made him come back. Another thing I think everyone is interested in seeing are the aliens he's unlocked. My fingers are crossed for another appearance of Spitter, but I also would like to get a sneak peek of aliens we've never seen before. I always like the idea of them taking concept aliens that didn't make it into the past war series and bringing them to light within the reboot. It stated that Ben 10,010 goes back in time to get help from his younger self, which begs the question if Professor Paradox helps him go into that time period or we see the reboot's debut of Clockwork or some other time traveling alien since it seems like Gwen isn't going to develop her magical abilities this time around. Timbuktu did temporarily have access to a time manipulating device last season, so maybe that was foreshadowing for this event and we see the return of Area 55. As for a release date, I'm not sure. I'm seeing February 20th, but I saw that might just be the release date like somewhere in Spain or something. Uh, that's pretty much all we really know about the special. We'll have to wait and see for more information though. But as I'm recording this, the 20th is a week away, so I'm pretty sure we would have gotten an official trailer from Cartoon Network by now. Two other season five specials are titled, but little is known about them at the moment, with those being Alien Extinction, which by the name clearly has something to do with the return of Celestial Sapiens, who were teased in the form of Alien V, 
in versus the universe and the other special is titled Ben Gen 10 which I think could mean one of two things number one this could be the debut of the reboots version of Generator Rex and I only say that because T Kelly Turnbull a member of the art department of Ben 10 shares some photos of the crew's artwork and in the corner you can see there's a little doodle of Rex. My second guess is that Gen could be short for generation and we'll be seeing this generation of Ben 10 meet the previous version. Although if it is a Generator Rex crossover, although if it is hinting at Rex, I'd like to see this version kind of be a new addition of Team Tennyson maybe, or a member of whatever the plumbers look like in this reboot. Also, if Rex is being introduced, are we saying Evos are just a thing in this universe now? Or is he just a mutant? But that's all we know at the moment about these specials. Of course, in due time, we'll know all there is to know about them. But until then, I'll see you when I see you. Side note. I don't know about you, but there's something really oddly satisfying about saying Ben 10,010.